Sabalski, let's do this. And we are about set to drop the puck on this one. The Canucks start with possession as we are now underway. Nice pass. Moves it quickly over to Hughes. Blocked in traffic. Picked up along the wall by Barry. They've got numbers. It's a two-on-one. Miller's got it through center. Delayed penalty coming up here. Whistle blows the play dead. Goaltender can't even get out. Interference is the call here, Ray. If he moves his feet just a little bit more, he's in better position. As they step into the face-off circle, let's see if they can take advantage on this power play. Doesn't matter whether you've had one or ten power plays. The fundamentals of it are the same. Win the draw, get the puck to the point, try and spread the penalty killers out. Centering pass! Oh, and cuts up with nothing on the play! No, he's got to get that on target. That's a scoring chance, and he doesn't even make a, the goaltender make a save. Puck picked up by Besser. Moves it around along the half wall. Hammers it on net. Oh, what a stop. Pretty good stop here early in the game for Freddie Anderson. The big Dane, really calm in goal, James. And great hustle to come up with the puck. Vancouver's got a hold of it along the wall. Intercepts the pass. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Riley's back out onto the ice as we are back to even strength here. That was a great shot, but an even better save. Always frustrating for the power play when they go back to the bench and don't have anything to show for it. Up along the wing. Takes the pass from the left wing. Moves it to Marner. And that one's blocked! Vancouver's got the puck along the wall. Slides it over to Myers. And he passes it up ahead to Sutter. Look out, a two-on-one. Great save by the goaltender. Just real smart positioning on that one. Another stop by the goaltender. After the first stop, he's in good position to make a second. From the point, looks to make something happen. And a great save. Too much traffic in the lane. And it's a quick pass to Miller. Toss it up in the neutral zone. Unleashes a cannon. Big save by the goaltender. draw here inside the offensive zone he takes that pass back at the point moves the puck inside the offensive zone Vancouver's looking to break out of their own end oh and they go back on offense great chance in front and that one's broken up by a great defensive play puts it on net and he puts it wide you have to get it on net here you've got a great chance to score and you don't even test the goalie on the attack along the boards. Unloads a shot. Big time stop. Quick feed to Tanev. Out front. And he can't get it off. And the shot dies in the traffic jam. That's wide of the net. You don't get the puck dead center very often. He's got to capitalize. You wonder if that'll come back to haunt them. And now he angles it across to Nylander. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. Uh, the defenders can regroup right now. That's a long time they've been chasing the puck around in their zone. They look like they've got nothing left in the tank. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Takes the bank feed. Picks it off. They go back on the attack. And the puck is in, but it's being waved off immediately here. Yeah, I like when all goals count, but I, I think this has to be waved off. This is goalie interference. Well, nobody likes having a goal called back, but they'll just have to play on as the puck's about to drop. Beagles won the draw here in the open ice. Stetcher's got the puck. Here's a backhand. Oh, and he was that close from putting it in. Things happen so quickly. He wants to deliver that puck quickly and accurately. He only got half of it right. Game of inches. Jabs the puck away. Look out. Sends it down low. Back to the point it goes. Sutter's got it along the boards. Oh, I like this, James. They've really cycled the puck well on this shift. Now they can hold it, and you put the pressure on the defenders. Eventually, they pull you down, or you get a great chance. Pass right in 
front. Toronto's got the puck in their own end. Toronto's got the puck here in the open ice. Knocked around, but keeps it going. Back on a stick now. Sends it out right in front. Scores! Oh, what a one-timer to bury it! Really nice play. Quick pass on the tape and into the net. So quickly, the goalie can't get closed up and make the save. Face off here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. Nice defensive robbery on that. Gauthier's taken down to the ice. We got a penalty coming up. Let's get the official decision. We got a minor penalty coming up here. For sure, on this one. James. I mean, this call was going to be made. You could see the play develop, and now they're going to have to serve two minutes. Well, as both teams dig in for the face off here just moments away, it's our first opportunity to look at the power play unit here. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. Receives the pass. Slides the puck near the front of the net. Whoa! Scores! Oh, that was a beauty! That's just a minute between goals. Wow, insane how quick that was. Bang, bang. Yeah, the defending team just couldn't put a stake in the ground. They couldn't stop them. While the centers are jammed up, nice job by the winger to steal the puck. Janssen's got it along the wing. Quick feed down low. Tries to get the puck to Edler. The first period comes to a conclusion. Vancouver's defense turns into good offense. A couple of goals here in the opening frame gives them a 2-0 lead. of regulation still to play. We're looking forward to it. Hopefully you are too. A nice little break for the defenseman here. One less forward to deal with as we have some four-on-four -four hockey on tap. Four-on-four four play usually starts pretty cautiously. It takes one missed pass or one missed shot, and all of a sudden, there's man advantage breaks opening up all over. Quick pass to Tanev. Vancouver's got it along the wall. Makes the save! We got a Whoa. delayed call coming up here as the referee raises his hand. And he sprints to the bench to get the extra attacker out on the ice. And there's the whistle. Let's get the call from the official here. Miller's going off for charging. Pretty easy call for the official here. You travel that far to make a hit, you're often going to get a charging penalty. Good read by the winger as the two centers tie up. Big time stop there. And off the save, that one's redirected out of play. Lots of time left in this period. Vancouver's got a 2-0 lead. Center's jammed up, and the winger grabs the puck. Oh, he stops him with the glove. Great reflexes there. And manages to clear the zone. The Leafs get nothing here on this power play. We're back to even strength. These are the power plays that drive coaches crazy. They didn't really generate anything. They didn't force the penalty killers at all. Kind of a waste of time. Chance in front! Blocker saved by the goalkeeper. Carries it in. Picked up along the boards by Tavares. Vancouver's got the puck. Great defensive effort with the strip. Sends the pass over. Drives it to the front of the net. It's an opportunity for the power play unit to go to work now as the penalty expires. Tries to get it over to Besser. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Miller's teammates kill off the penalty. Well, as that penalized player comes out of the penalty box, he can give a nod down to his penalty-killing unit. They did their job. Outstanding work. A little crashing and banging forces the turnover. Matthews carries the puck in his own zone and tries to make a diagonal pass to Janssen. Long reach breaks up the momentum. 
Let's it go. Great save by the goaltender who was in the right place at the right time. Here's an opportunity in front of the net. Here's a short pass to Tanev. Vancouver's got it in the offensive zone. Stopped by the goaltender. Taken along the wall by Pearson. Slides the puck over to Janssen. Here's a shot. Makes the save. Moves it quickly over to Tanev. Great timing to come up with the interception. Hughes has the puck inside the defensive zone. Cannon of a shot. Too much congestion in front. Vancouver's gained possession along the boards. Vancouver's moving it into the offensive end. Right in front. What a great read breaking up the pass. Vancouver's got a hold of it against the wall. And now it's grabbed by Clifford. Taken by Muzzin. Offside the call, and we'll have a face-off just outside the blue line. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period, and it's a 2-0 hockey game. This neutral zone face-off set to go, and we are back underway. We got a penalty coming up here on the play. The goaltender is quickly off to his bench to get the extra attacker out. And the official stops the play as somebody's off to the sin bin. Kapanen's getting two for interference here. He's off to the box. Sometimes you get caught in the wrong spot on the ice. He clearly interferes with the other player's progress. Wrong place, wrong time. You're right on that one, Ray. Vancouver's got another opportunity here on the man advantage. Sometimes you have to have the shortest of memories when you play on a specialty unit like the power play. It hasn't gone very well for them so far tonight. They have to beat the goaltender but couldn't beat the post. And he gets his glove out to stop the pinball shot. I like the goalie's positioning here. He was aggressive enough to make a save on a dangerous chance. Vancouver's lead here in the second period, a direct result of being the more aggressive team offensively. Off the try, and a nice job locking up his opponent. Slides the puck ahead to Hyman. Hyman's going to play it against the half wall and makes the save. More than half the period has expired. Vancouver's got some breathing room as they lead it 2-0. Toronto's won the faceoff. Oh, a clutch save! Vancouver's got it in their own zone. With the one-timer. And the traffic neutralizes that threat. Sets up from Gretzky's office. Really solid shift here. Their puck possession game has been outstanding. Now they've got it again, and they can hold it down underneath the blue line. Vancouver's got control of it now from their own end. The Canucks can't convert to the power play. Both sides are back to even strength. Penalty coming up here as the play is stopped. Officials calling tripping here on this one. This was the penalty I think when I took, I was most angry at myself because you're not trying to do it. And then all of a sudden, you see the guy go down, and you're just like, ah, oh, man, here I go. There's the result. Vancouver's on the attack. And he gets the puck right back. And he regains control of the puck. Vancouver's got the puck against the half wall. Puck lands right back onto the blade. Long jam in front. That's broken up. Now he slides it up to Marner. Tries to get it to Marner. Here's a chance, a two-on-one. Here's a chance right in the slot. Toronto's got the puck along the boards. And he gives it over to Pearson. Vancouver's got the puck along the wall. Here's a rocket of a shot. Oh, what a stop. And he's ridden off the puck. Moves the puck from off the bank pass. The Canucks fail to capitalize on the man advantage. Both sides back to even strength. And he's taken down the official's arm, signaling for a penalty. Here comes the official's call. Pedersen's called for tripping. He's off to the box. Trying to get to the puck, he reaches his stick right into the guy's feet, and down he goes. Another power play opportunity coming up here. Power play always feels a little bit nervous when they've given up a shorty in a game as they did earlier. But here's another chance. Go get a power play goal, even it up. Moves it to Tanev. Nice pass back. Puck grabbed by Nylander. Quick feed to Marner. 
Shot shuts him down. Oh, and another big stop. Denies him. He's right on it. Two consecutive saves. Tough ones at that. From their own end, trying to kickstart this power play. Quick pass to Nylander. Good reach to the stick to knock the puck away. Tanev swooping in on the attack. Vancouver's got a hold of it along the wall. Rips it along the wall, and he gets in the lane to block that. Knocked away. Pedersen's penalty has expired. Well, they got through that one. Their penalty killing has just been average tonight. But they'll take that one and put it in the good column. Vancouver's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Pucks it away in his own end. Puck scooped up by Janssen. And they can't connect. Toronto's ready to go on the attack. Last minute of play. Along the half wall with the puck. Puts it to the front of the net. Takes it right in the chest. And the referee has blown his whistle, bringing a stop to the play. Vancouver's generated a lot of quality scoring chances, which is why they lead here late in the second. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. A little dipsy doodle, and he loses possession of the puck. Hey, kids, don't forget if you're a member of our rookie team. Welcome back, everyone. Both teams lined up at center ice, and we are ready to get this third period underway. Moment of truth for one team. Here we go. Third period is underway. Ray, with two periods in the books, what are your thoughts on the game to this point? Toronto's been chasing this game and chasing the puck much of the first two periods. If they're going to get back in it, they've got to possess the puck a lot more. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. 2-0 is the score. Puck is dropped and play resumes. Puck picked up by Riley. Gaining momentum up along the side. Marner's got it against the boards. Vancouver's looking to break out of their own end. And now it's over to Besser. All alone! What a stop by the goalie on the poke! Yeah, that's a good read to be able to do that. He stays in front of the shooter and pokes it off his stick. Reads it perfectly in the defensive end. Keeps hold of the puck. Edler's moving the puck through his own zone. Good defensive effort to poke it away. From the... Scores! Mitch Marner! That shot just overpowered him, I guess. He stopped most of it. It just trickled through and rolled into the net. Toronto's come back with a big one here in the third. Grind away, dig away, now you got a chance. Only trailing by one goal. Vancouver's got a hold of the puck off the draw. Right side set up ahead into the middle of the ice. Here they come on the attack. Here's a short pass to Tavares. Puts it on net, comes up with the stop. Elects to play the puck. Vancouver's moving the puck through center ice. Vancouver's got the puck against the boards. Vancouver's got it behind the net. Oh, what a heads-up play to poke it away. The Leafs gain control of the puck against the wall. And now he moves it to Janssen. Intercepts it at center. Picks off the feed. It's a two-on-one. Takes a shot with the stop. Scooped up along the wall by Janssen. Denies him again. And now it's grabbed by Kapanen. And a poke check knocks the puck away. Takes the puck along the boards. Moves it quickly over to Kapanen. And that one's turned away. Really good positioning as he makes the stop from in tight. Takes the feed. Carries it across the line. Gets that puck back on a stick. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Taken by Sutter. Moves it to Mott. Hammers the shot, denies him on the play. He was telling me this morning he worked on this in practice this week, making sure the puck goes to the corner and doesn't stay in the net. And skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. Grabbed along the boards by Spezza. 
Oh, what a stop with the stick. Into the corner now. Excellent stick work on the play. Tries to feed it over to Sutter. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Rips it. Comes up with the glove save. And he elects to play the puck. And now he tries to get it across to Kerfoot. And we've got a two-on-one. Quick feed to Clifford. Here's a race for the loose puck. Vancouver's got the puck along the wall. Quick snap. Big save. Misses the net. You're going to go back and kick yourself for that one because he wants that on the net. He doesn't miss it by much. Clifford's got the puck in his own zone. Picked up along the wall by Dermott. And we'll get a stoppage on the ice here. Yeah, the puck sails down to the far end of the ice. He'll go back to the defensive zone and try it again. Here in the dying moments of this period, Vancouver's got a slim lead. They lead it 2-1. While the setters are jammed up, nice job by the winger to steal the puck. Toronto's grabbed a hold of the puck. Puts it towards the net, turns it away. Grabs the puck in the corner. Quick pass to Toffoli. Shoots it, stopped by the goaltender. Grabs the puck in the slot. Puck grab by Miller. An easy save by Anderson. Feeds it to Clifford. Pass right back. Great stick work with the steal. Nice poke check. Picked up along the boards by Hole. Here's a short pass to Kerfoot. Slides the puck across to Hole. Thunderous hit. Well, that's inevitable. He had his head down, got hit so hard he dropped his stick. Now he's got to go pick it up before he can join the play again. Why well, coaches say keep your head up, right? Well, that's one of the reasons. Pedersen's going to try and shake this off and get back into the game, but he took a heavy hit there. Vancouver's been the better team offensively tonight. A lot of scoring chances, and they lead it late in this third period. And that shot gets caught in traffic. Vancouver's gained possession along the boards. And now he angles it across to Miller. Toronto's got the puck in their own end. Directs it on over to Hyman. Here's a chance on the doorstep. And that one's broken up. Comes up with the stop. Fires it off target. The Leafs have missed too many good chances in this contest. They're trailing because they can't finish anything. Nice speed from the left side up the middle. Snaps it on net. What a chance. At some point, you got to get this puck on the net. I know he doesn't miss by much, but the goalie doesn't even have to make a stop. Oh, there's going to be a penalty on this play here, James. And that'll do it from ringside here. Vancouver special teams really come off huge. In this